Can you tell me anything about yourself? Who you are, where you came from? Can you tell me your name? I, uh, I can't remember anything. <laughs> Rise and shine. What is this place? Welcome to the lake. Who put us here? We don't know. What's through there? You guys can't just keep me here. I can't let you leave. Why won't you tell me what's out there? That's the maze. Every morning when those doors open, the runners look for a way out. And no one has ever survived a night in the maze. What happened, sir? We call them grievers. We don't belong here. Somebody built the maze. I think it's time we find out what we're really up against. Do not let the others be curious. What the hell is that? This is the first real clue you found. Who knows where this might lead us? It's a go. Thomas. Everything started changing the moment you showed up. What if we were sent here for a reason? The doors aren't closing. They're here. We're gonna keep coming back until they kill us all. We get out now or we die trying. We're already dead. is dedicated to Barbie Minaj, who was so patient yet also persistent in getting me to review the second trailer for The Maze Runner. So Barbie, this is for you. Now I'm still very excited about this movie, but I think that the second trailer was a mistake because it just really is an extended version of the first trailer, which raises some red flags to me. Uh, it makes me feel the movie is going to just be what I'm seeing, only more and more. Now, of course, obviously, it just takes place in a single location, this maze, so I guess that should have been obvious. But this second trailer just starts to hit home as to what you're signing on for. So that means in order for this to hold our attention, same location, same problem throughout the entire movie, it has to have a phenomenal story and a, an amazing cast who hand in fantastic performances. Now obviously they can't give away too much of the story uh, and they've already set it up very nicely with the first trailer. So I think the second trailer should have highlighted the cast, maybe uh, character trailers, uh, pointing out each and every character and who we'll get to spend this movie with. And I applaud this movie for its diversity. I'm not familiar with the original uh, book, uh, and I wonder if they had this much diversity in the sor uh, uh, source material, but I think for a film, it's very unique and it's refreshing, uh, and it looks like everyone's doing a great job. And they're not playing stereotypical characters. You know, everyone's just a person. So I'm very excited to see that work out, and I'm excited to see the talent they found to fit these roles, because they're giving opportunities to actors that usually can't find uh, a lot of opportunity, so you're going to have some new discoveries, which I think is also very exciting. And I think this lead actor from uh, Teen Wolf, uh, as I thought from the first trailer, looks very, 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 very good. Uh, so I'm excited. I'm a little hesitant now, though, because I'm like, wow, I am in for a movie that's just basically a very long version of this trailer. Uh, and so I'm hopeful that the film can deliver. Also, I also thought was a little alarming with this trailer is that some of the shots are so dark. And I don't know if that's to save on um, special effects budget because they're like, well, you only have to see a little bit of that crazy thing that's uh, it's chasing them, uh, and that'll save us some money. But it just looks very murky, very dark, and sometimes, you know, especially when you add 3D to that and the 3D glasses darken the screen a little bit, you know, I like to see what I'm looking at. But as I said, I have a lot of faith. The first trailer for this fil um, film was so strong, and I do feel the cast is strong that I'm hoping that the story delivers. And so many of you are so much uh, fans of the source material of the original book that. It must be 
a pretty darn good story. So what do you think? Do you think the second trailer was a good uh, a good idea? Do you like it? Or do you think it, uh, as, do you agree with me that it's just a little bit too repetitive of the first trailer? And would you have liked to see it to learn a little bit more about the characters in the second trailer? This film comes out very soon, so I don't know if we're going to ever get that. But uh, regardless, what character are you the most excited for? If those of you who've read the book and those of you who haven't, just from what you're seeing from this trailer. Write your thoughts down below. Thank you again, Barbie, for being so patient yet persistent, and I hope that you enjoyed my review. Thanks, everyone. Bye.